Molly historically um, was a term that was uh, given as sort of a softer term for what was thought to be pure uh, ecstasy or, or um, uh, methylene deoxymethamphetamine. Um, and so the idea was that it was a drug that could be taken by people who wanted to have a euphoria and maybe get high, go to parties and stuff like that, um, but without the, the thought of having serious side effects that were related to things like cocaine and um, uh, methamphetamines. Um, the issue that we've come into recently now is that um, Molly, what is being billed as Molly by uh, drug dealers to their users isn't the pure Molly um, that was initially billed back, you know, a decade ago. Um, it's now thought to be a co-formulation of a multiple, multiple different adulterants, um, which could range anywhere from caffeine to talcum powder to uh, cocaine, even to other amphetamine-like substances. And so the, the thought is that, you know, it's just become another one of these quote-unquote designer drugs um, that's just being marketed to a new population of younger kids, ages, you know, typically 16 to 24. The user really has no idea what they're ingesting. Um, they have an idea. They think that they're taking in something pure, which is, like I said, just going to lead to the positive effects that they were hoping for. However, it's, um, uh, you know, because of the co-formulated adulterants, things like amphetamines and, you know, other methamphetamines and cocaine-like products or caffeine products, they're leading to things like elevated heart rate and blood pressure, elevated body core temperature, um, which have their own sequelae and downstream side effects, leading to muscle breakdown and kidney failure and electrolyte abnormalities, which can lead to seizures, um, bleeding in your brain, and, and again, you know, in, in the severe instances, is um, people are dying from some of these you know terminal sequelae people who are going to be ingesting any kind of substances need to be smart about it they need to realize that what they're being billed as sold may not truly be that um, the, the the individuals that are using these products just need to frankly be aware that Molly is not the Molly they thought it was before. Um, it is not pure, um, or it, it absolutely has the potential to not be pure, and they should expect to have you know, bad side effects.